So Jillian, good to see you back from camp. Hi Jen. Let people know your experience with camp. I went to camp for the first time right before I started sixth grade. It was 2013. Yeah, 2013. Jen made me go. She didn't actually make me go. Um, but it was the first time I'd ever stayed away from home for more than like two nights. Um, I'd never stayed away from home without my parents like that before. So it was kind of weird that Jen took me like many states away and I just wanted to go to camp. But my friend Addie was going. So I went to camp for five years and then I took a little bit of a break, but I couldn't stay away from camp for too long. So now I work there. Awesome. And so you have been at Luther Ridge, which is in North Carolina, uh, a camping uh, facility that offers both family camp and youth camp. And so why should parents, in your own words, send their kids a couple states away with Jen Jarman for summer camp? So uh, first of all, there's a lot of options that we have. We have options for families to come and you can stay with your family for the whole week, um, whether that's if you have young kids and you don't think they're really old enough or you know you have super young ones that just don't aren't old enough to be in our programs yet, that's totally fine. Um, so we have family camps, we also have grands camps, if you have grandparents that wanna to come to camp with your kids. Um, but also we have independent kid programs. Those are the ones that I always went to. Those are the campers that I typically have. Um, and something that's really important that I like to remember about camp is that camp is one of the first times really that your child has that opportunity to create their own faith and experience God for themselves. Obviously, it's really important for families to experience God together, and that's something that Good Shepherd focuses on a lot. But those experiences of having your faith on your own are what really solidify your faith journey for you and help you to have that personal relationship with God outside of just that routine of coming to church each week, coming to events every year. And so we did go to camp a couple states away, but you also made some lasting friendships. Um, so could you say a little bit more about that and your experience of how camp friends became lifelong friends? Yeah, so I believe it was either my first or second year at camp. Honestly, I don't really remember at this point. I'm sorry, maybe that just says I'm old. But I made a friend in my cabin one year. Her name is Grace Caroline. She and I are still best friends to this day. We see each other probably like every other year, maybe if we're lucky. Um, but I met her at camp. We saw each other at the youth gathering. She goes to Clemson now and I go to school in North Carolina. So we're even closer now. But that's just to say that those friends that you meet at camp really are lifelong friendships. And we make bonds that you can't make anywhere else because everyone's away from home. Everyone's in God's creation. Everyone's trying new things that they've never done before. And so that's something really important that helps us make those friendships. So thanks Jillian for pumping us up about camp. And if you wanna know anything else about camp, uh, Jillian and I will be hosting a Camp Curious Dinner. Sign up via Realm and check out where our camps are and more information about them in the links below.